my name is Sean Abolaji, uh, co-founder of Wilson's Juice Company. At the moment, I'm the director of sales and marketing with Wilson's. Wilson's Juice Company started in 2010 uh, in a very humble way. Uh, we just had a plastic juicer and a bag of oranges to begin with. And we were just making orange juice at Covenant University. Just fresh squeezed orange juice we were selling. And from there we went to smoothies. And then from after that we saw some lemons in the market and started making lemonade. And very quickly it was just lemonade that we were making. Fresh squeezed lemonade in cups, selling to students. And then we said, let's, let's put it in a plastic bottle. And uh, when we put it in a plastic bottle, we just started seeing people asking for lemonade all the time. And from there, step by step by step by step, the business has just been improving and getting better every year. When we were thinking about capital and to start the business, it, we didn't have where we are in mind or where we're going in mind. So we just use our personal money. Uh, it's my brother and my money, and then family and friends. That just, when we asked, and they just gave us some money to do what we came here to do. Initially, we had another business, um, Palm Kernel Oil business, and that didn't work out the way we wanted it to work out. So uh, when Wilson's came about, we just used the money that we had there and the money that you know, I was working as a pharmacist in, uh, in New York, so I'd be sending money back um, to my brother here. And so we used that money to start the business. And so we didn't really source, as in with VC or PE capital in the beginning. We're just kind of blood, sweat, and tears to push the business forward. Biggest challenge as a business is, is an interesting question to ask about the biggest challenge because, it's, I mean, our environment is a big challenge in itself, but we don't like to focus on the challenges because everyone has those challenges. We want to focus on the opportunity, and the opportunity is to do something truly amazing. Um, when you drink our lemonade, it's made from real fruit, real citrus, um, water, and it's sweetened with uh, real cane sugar. And it's such a different thing in the market, and trying to push that is, has been interesting. We really don't see as we're competing. Um, not even that. We decided to do something that's not a me too product, as in we decided to bring something new to the market, something creative, something different. Uh, if you think about what our company is about, we're about leadership, four different things, which is sacrifice, creativity, integrity, and teamwork. And with that, we've been able to not compete. We've been able to bring something new to the market uh, at the end of the day, we're all competing for stomach space, yes. But what we've brought to the market, it's not, a, it's not fizzy, it's not sugary, it's not uh, just flavoring and sweetener. It's actually a real juice product. And so because of that, we've created our own lane and it's for us to now dominate the market. The, the beautiful thing we were talking about the other day is, yes, in Nigeria it is, two major players, one that starts with C, one that starts with P. There's no number three. Why can't it be Wilson's? So that's why we question ourselves every day. And it's not a defeatist point of view, it's just that's the reality of the situation. Why can't there be a number three? So every day we're working, pushing to get to that next level so that when people think, oh, what are the brands in Nigeria? They're like, oh, okay, P, C, Wilson's, that'd be, a, that'd be a great place for us to be. So we're pushing, we're striving every day to do that. Wilson's five-year goal. So we have a two-year goal, we have a five-year goal, we have a 10-year goal. Our vision is to be Africa's leading natural beverage producer, owning the, the, the coolest and freshest brands in Africa.